Verse of the day the 20th of July 2023. Defend the weak and the fatherless. Uphold the cause of the poor and the oppressed. Psalm 82, 3. Thoughts on today's verse. This verse begins with the command to defend the weak and the fatherless, urging those in positions of authority and influence to stand up and protect those who lack support and protection. The fatherless, orphans, and widows were often considered among the most vulnerable in ancient times. The verse continues with the directive to uphold the cause of the poor and the oppressed. This emphasizes the importance of advocating for the rights and well-being of those who are economically disadvantaged and marginalized. It reflects God's heart for the downtrodden and his desire for his people to be instruments of justice and compassion. Psalm 82, 3 serves as a call to action for believers, reminding us of our responsibility to seek justice, defend the vulnerable, and care for those in need. It aligns with the broader biblical theme of God's concern for the poor and the oppressed, challenging us to reflect his character in our interactions with others. As followers of God, we are encouraged to be proactive in promoting fairness, equality, and kindness, extending his love to all, regardless of their social standing or circumstances. Prayer for the day, Heavenly Father, I come before you with a heart burdened by the plea in Psalm 82, 3. You call us to defend the weak, care for the fatherless, and uphold the cause of the poor and oppressed. Today, I lift up these vulnerable members of society before you, knowing that your heart is deeply compassionate towards them. Lord, I pray for your guidance and wisdom in discerning the ways I can make a difference in the lives of those in need. Show me how to be an advocate for the defenseless and a voice for the voiceless. Grant me the courage to stand up for justice and mercy, even in the face of opposition or indifference. Father, open my eyes to the opportunities to extend your love and compassion to those who are hurting and struggling. Lead me to individuals or organizations where I can offer my support and resources to alleviate their burdens. May I be your hands and feet in reaching out to the marginalized, bringing comfort, hope, and assistance where it is needed. Lord, empower me to break down the barriers that divide us, recognizing that we are all your children, created in your image. Help me to set aside prejudices and judgments, and to treat each person with the dignity and respect they deserve. Thank you, Father, for your example of unwavering love and compassion. Teach me to reflect your character in my interactions with others. May my actions align with your desire for justice, mercy, and kindness in this world. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen.